Now that you've downloaded the Lincolnize app, let's connect to our camera and launch the app. Go to your phone's Wi-Fi. Make sure that your phone Wi-Fi is connected with your camera's Wi-Fi. Once you are connected, you are ready to launch the app. This is the live view of your patrolized camera. Your app appearance will vary slightly between horizontal and vertical viewing. Controls might not be visible on startup, but if you click anywhere in this live view area, your controls will appear. This is the main screen when using the Wi-Fi app. Some indicators in your live video mode include wireless signal, photo and video quality, settings, files, date, current time, video, photo, and record. Your controls can appear or disappear by tapping on the live window or hitting this little button right here. To record, tap the record icon. You can hear indicators from the camera and also you can see flashing on the record icon when you are recording. In your upper left hand corner you have another record icon showing that you are recording and your recording time. To stop recording tap the record icon again. To take a photo switch over to photo mode and press the red shutter button. A preview window appears of your most recent files which you can click on to view and scroll through your past files, videos and photos. Now let's look at our settings menu. From here we can change patrolized camera settings and app settings. Camera settings include video resolution, video quality, photo resolution, date and time setting, camera and storage format, camera free space, and which firmware version you are running. From here you can change Lincolnize app settings. There's also an area under the settings to view your files. All files, video files, or just photo files. This is your app file manager. From here you can view and download photo and video files. If you'd like to download, press the download icon and the video or photo file will save to your phone. 
Now that you've downloaded and installed the Patrolize cam management software on your computer, let's run the software and go over some of its features. Place your camera into the docking station and plug the docking station into your computer via USB cable. Your camera will power on and connect to the PC. Let's log in to the CAM Manager software. We will log in as an administrator and we'll use the default password that is shown in the manual that came with your Patrolize camera. General users can view and download media files only, while administrators can make changes to camera settings as well as view and download files. After login, the camera management software will load to the camera info tab. There are also tabs for parameter settings and passwords. Let's go back and look at the first tab that the camera management software opens to on login. This is your camera info tab. From here, you can change device ID, user ID, and the Wi-Fi password as well as view battery level and camera storage free space. Change the settings as desired by entering values into the text blocks. Then click apply to save. Click refresh to get an updated battery level and storage level reading if the camera has been plugged in for a length of time. Click Open File Explorer to view the camera's files. File Manager will open. From here you can view, transfer, and delete files. When finished, close the File Manager by clicking the X. Click Sync PC Date Time to update your camera's date and time. The date and time will be updated to your PC's current date and time. The next tab in your camera management software is the parameter settings tab, otherwise known as your camera settings. Select the setting you want to change and a drop down menu will appear with all available options. Camera setting options include resolution, photo size, Video splitter. This is the amount of time each video segment will be in length. Recording notifications. Date format. Basically how your date will appear. TV out. Post record settings, burst photo mode settings, quality, auto infrared, Infrared Sensitivity Your camera's video file format Auto Power Off This is the amount of time before your camera will automatically power off in standby mode. This time will not be reflected if the camera is in use. Refresh rate. File tagging. Wi-Fi start. Other settings include microphone mute on or off. Stealth mode on or off. 
file protection on or off, LED lights on or off, beep sounds on or off, power up auto record on or off, Pre-record, on or off. Watermark, on or off. Pre-record, mute, on or off. Click Apply to save your changed camera settings. The third tab in the CAM management software is Passwords. From here, you can change device passwords. Select the user type for the password you want to change. Enter the admin password, then enter the new password. Click Apply to save the new password. Please note, all passwords can only be changed while logged into the admin account. Please refer to the instruction manual included with your patrolized camera. The manual is also available online in the link in the description of this video.